when I was a kid, I remember watching footage from the Intifada. I used to have these dreams that the IDF would come to our house in Missouri, dragging us out of our homes and lining us up and executing us, which is a crazy dream for a 12-year-old to have. It was the first introduction to realizing that I was in the category of human being whose life didn't matter. Palestine was the lens through which I saw the world from such a young age. I learned about it as this fundamental injustice that affected me and people that I loved. My grandparents lived in Jerusalem up until 1948. They were forced to flee. They really thought they were gonna go back. My grandmother had the key to her house for the rest of her life. 48, 67, they're all iterations of the same thing, which is occupation. They don't value our lives. They don't value our history. They're literally trying to erase us. They think if they wait long enough that we will just forget about it. We'll forget that our grandmothers died with the keys to their houses and we'll just move on. But when I meet Palestinians, we haven't forgotten and we'll never forget and we will never stop fighting for Palestine because Palestine's everything.